welcome back to my channel and today is a vlog boop, 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 boop. finally after so many who oh, hassles of life i am finally vlogging today it is probably spend a day with me or i don't know how the vlog is gonna go or where you wanna get with the vlog but today it's quite a beautiful day i woke up well thankful to god that i'm able to breathe and i am still alive so today it's a vlog if you don't know me by now my name is Bikanyo. oh you are new here don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel so that you can become a member of this family we love people i do everything vlogs cooking yonkinto yonkintipo yawasha chat so today it's a beautiful day it's sunny outside even though it's a little bit cold it's currently nine and we are going to corn hill to shoot a reel and also shoot my pictures for my instagram and if you don't follow me on instagram my instagram handle i'll put it on the screen but it's at bikanya underscore bowie so we're going to do that today i also have to do go to this game and get some tissues some soap some things some toiletries and i also need to go get my baby washed okay because i can't be clean and she's dirty so that's what we're gonna do let's go and look good and go to cornhill baby i'll see you guys there so i'm finally done with my makeup and getting dressed don't i look good a beautiful girl so we are about to leave and go to cornhill um uh, the internet or everybody says that's where Winnie Madigazela was arrested and that's where lockdown the best series in the world was shot directed by Mandla N so I, I want to see all that things all the history because now it's it is a museum where you can just go and see guys so we have finally arrived we had already shot my reel and it looks it's popping baby so we are currently in the jail where Winnie Madikizawa was held and hmm, it looks dope it looks nice I'll just show you guys snippets of everything while we are still walking I'm with my boo thing <laughs> so let's go So guys I am at a place where they used to eat and do their laundry which is like so weird how they used to wash their laundry like every after two weeks a blanket you'd sleep with it like for the whole time without washing it and I'm just gonna give you a snippet probably you guys won't see but hey man this is how it looks that's the place as you guys can see you can see chairs there so yeah let's go and see other places So I am right now at the women's jail as you guys can see 
this is where Winnie was held, Lillian was held, um, a lot of them guys and reading their stories just makes me emotional realizing how women have fought for us and who guys it's a lot so it was quite a great experience for me coming here even though it made me quite emotional learning how a, a woman bought her dress in a in a boutique in Saint in Johannesburg and um, police didn't want her to attend her own wedding it's like crazy but hey man Let's go. Hey guys, so right now we are at a different prison where like Nessa Mandela was held and others. And we are also learning about how they would um, punish them. They say there yeah. was never any question when you looked at this jail. It was designed to punish. There was never any intention here of treating prisoners with any degree of humanity. Hmm, guys, there was no humanity here. It was insane. This is like insane. But it's good to learn. It's really good to learn. Let's see what's in here. We have finally arrived in Tata Mandela's um, cell and I have read all about his diaries that are from the 1976 to 1989 that were ordered from the duties and um, I also learned a few about his letters about the prison, photographies of the island, everything about him that he has done it's here so it's so beautiful how how he had worked so hard and how smart he was and everything that has to do with him is proper so yeah i think we are done in the cell I managed to get in one and you guys can feel the echo. It doesn't look good. It's too small for me. Whew, it's super scary and I'm getting emotional of how everything happened in the apartheid. But hey man, we are growing and we are learning. And yeah, so let's go. guys I'm about to enter a place where Nelson Mandela and them used to do their, their laundry wash their blankets and wait on the Sun until it dries up because all that happens um, every after two weeks or three weeks so let's go and this is how it looks Guys, this is where they were washing. It's like a, a, a um, like where you wash a bucket, but that one that's on the wall. So you can imagine ten flippant people washing in this small little thing. Already, just me myself. It's a, it's, it's too small. But yeah, this is where they were doing their laundries, doing their washing, their blankets, and having to sit here so that they can wait for them to dry. Yeah, guys, this is insane. Learning is power. So, guys, we are done with Constitutional Hill. Actually, where I'm standing right now, it is where they shot lockdown. I loved lockdown. I don't know about you guys, but it, it is the world's best thing. Lockdown was dope. Everybody loved it. So, it's so weird that I was standing where um, Natasha Tahani was. I mean, who's that? Lady, all of those people from the, the, the most beautiful actors that are doing a good job. So right now we are about to go to Mabone where I'm gonna shoot my um, pictures, my personal photographer is there, which is Tobiso baby. I'm gonna put his numbers down below so that you guys can 
you know contact him so we're going there to shoot my pictures because we could we couldn't get proper pictures here because they are a bit strict so let's go and shoot these things and get some food because i'm damn hungry period so guys we have finally arrived in Mabone and i'm about to have lunch i'm super hungry so we decided that we're gonna eat before the shoot and also my photographer is still charging his battery so we're quickly gonna bite on something and order a drink i ordered myself non-alcoholic baby so we are at rooftop love river it's so nice it's so chill nice music so let's have fun a bit before work begins okay period that I took you guys to Corn Hill with all the history and now I'm in Maboning and they're playing those Sophia Town songs with the Magic and the Mandela vibes you know everything is aligned the stars baby they are aligned okay hey guys so literally this is the end of the vlog i had quite a hectic day i didn't even take my car to the car wash i didn't go to this game to get everything that i wanted because child i had a long day the shoot ended at five and um we grabbed some drinks and i got home and i had to be on a long call with my mom so right now I'm about to sleep, just took a shower. I'm gonna eat. I'm having tea after having this tea while I catch up on some The Wife. Guys, if you don't watch The Wife, what are you doing with yourself? Cause The Wife is dope. <laughs> so I'm currently gonna watch The Wife and then it's chai for me. It's night shift. It's about to, I have to sleep right now. So it's currently quarter past nine. I'm gonna quickly eat catch up on the wife and then i'm out as for me i'm out so guys thank you guys for watching my vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel guys let's grow this channel we are on the road to 1000 subscribers period i'll see you guys in my next video bye